Alright guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is James. And I'm Tilbrush. And today we're going to be watching Haikyuu episode 17. Um, we're right in the middle of, of, or I guess we're right about to have our match with Date Tech. Yeah. So, I just want to get into this episode. We're in the middle of the tournament. Last episode was amazing. Uh, I, I really liked how they kind of covered a different angle. I'm curious to see how they do this match. I'm sure they're going to make me like Date Tech or some crazy BS because that's what this show does. Um, and I just want to get into this episode. So yeah, um, as always, full-length reaction is going to be up on our Patreon. Next week's reactions are going to be up on our Patreon. If you guys do want to check those out and support us, that would be awesome. But either way, thanks for joining us. Thank you for watching. There's going to be a free link in the description of the actual episode. And then you guys can come back here to hear our thoughts, theories, and reviews. Let's just get into Haikyuu episode 17. That was a great episode, man. That, uh, like, obviously, the animation of that entire game was incredible. But uh, just everything. Like, the, the way they combined... I really like these, like, side... Like, the girls team. I don't know why. Like, I like that they're focusing on side characters like that. Uh -huh. And it, it, they don't spend too much time on them because it's not about them. Yeah. But enough to where it's like, oh, I actually care about them as side characters. Yeah. And that's really cool. Um, But also, like... I don't even know. It... Just the way everything was done, and we had like a character moment for Asai, I thought was really cool. Yeah. Um, and even seeing Hinata develop, where he is starting to understand what it means to to play for a team. Yeah. And like understand the thrill of that. I think yeah. that's cool. And how about like Suga kind of realizing that he probably might not be the one to, you know, allow Asahi to kind of get over that sort of like fear you know yeah what I'm saying? i like, mean do you remember any of this uh like i remember like probably that last okay that okay, last okay. moment yeah um like I, it's really i watched it like when it was kind of like airing i don't know how long ago that was but like i don't remember any of the like you know, like, the actual game itself. To be yeah. honest, I probably just remember really big moments. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty hype for me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Suga, he's one of the most interesting characters, I think, in the show. The way they, they're kind of developing him, and it is interesting seeing how he deals with not being starting, um, but still, like, being supportive. And everything. I mean, even just the whole feel of the game. Like, I liked that... That if you've ever played sports, and I, I'm not great at sports or anything, but like mm -hmm. they, the way they capture even the difference in energy oh, of yeah, yeah. a practice game versus a real game, and how like people are screaming on the sidelines, and like there's just a feeling to it, and I can't tell you what the feeling is, but I felt that watching this. Yeah, and that's really hard to do. Oh um, yeah. And it's just a combination of a lot of, like, you know, I'm sure the way it's animated, but the sound design, just, just everything about it. Uh -huh. And it's crazy that an anime is able to capture that so vividly and so realistic. Like, it doesn't feel super cheesy and over the top. It yeah. feels really realistic. And I like that. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I don't know what's going to happen, man. I mean, like, like, we revealed all of our weapons, but here's the other thing, too. We still, like... If you have enough weapons, it doesn't matter whether you, obviously them not knowing you have certain weapons is the most powerful. But mm -hmm. if we have enough, and I don't know if we do, but if we have enough, it doesn't matter whether we've revealed them all or not. Because if we use them the right way, right? Like that's yeah. where the strategy comes in. If we use them differently enough, they won't be able to keep up. Yeah, it definitely makes it harder. Like, you know, once the enemy knows you're like, you got the trump card. Yeah. It is more difficult to say, like, hey, you know, all of a sudden, you know, we're not pulling it out of nowhere like we do. You no, know? but they still, but now, they don't know our plays. Well, we they got may like, know our, yeah. Yeah, we got, like, different, you know, alternatives that we can kind of go to. And it's like, yeah. you can't always predict them all or always, you know, cover all the spots. So it's going to be harder, right? But yeah. not. Now, I do think it's going to be a lot closer, too, because we're not great at defense. And I think that's why the score is as close as it is now, because yeah. we don't have great receiving, and we're not great at defense. And so we do have good offensive strategy. I think we yeah. do. And I think we have some plays. I think we're going to confuse them. But we're not great at defense, and so they will be able to keep scoring back. So that that difference in points is not going to be very big. Yeah, I feel like they do highlight that, that we you know, kind of mess up a a decent amount of yeah. times, and uh, they are continuing to like 
you know, score consistently. I was really impressed about how they were able to keep calm, too. I thought that was really impressive. Yeah. Because that's something that we've been seeing develop with Carcino, but hasn't always been there. And I think it's cool to see how calm they were and they didn't get flustered and they weren't letting the game get to them because that yeah. was really important. Yeah, oh yeah. And even little things like Hinata messing up the serve. Like, you know, I feel like back in the day or whatnot, like he probably would have, you know. He would have freaked out. Kageyama would have freaked out. Oh, Everyone yeah. would have freaked out. <laughs> Uh, but now they're starting to like yeah they're starting to grow into like that a little more mature team you know they've yeah, they've weathered a few more things in themselves yeah. trust that they'd be like no it's fine we're gonna win yeah like and and that is really important oh yeah hundred percent yeah I I mean this is awesome this is a great episode um but yeah as always the full end reaction is up on our Patreon um next week's reactions are also up on our Patreon if you guys want to check those out. Either way, though, thanks for joining us. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you stick around, give this video a like, subscribe. If you do, we'll see you all in the next video.